Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for July 24th, 2020. So today we have Shamael Serenity. Do you see this pattern? <laughs> it's, it's really, you know, all this chaos in the world, it has shaken us to our core. And we have the collective and the way the collective is responding to everything. And then we have our individual experiences, our own timelines, our own soul's contracts. And this whole like past few days has really been about, okay, okay, okay. Remember to come on back in. Remember that you don't have to suffer, all right? There is no honor in suffering through this. If you need help, reach out for it. And of course, that part of that help, okay? If you strictly coming from a spiritual standpoint, not from a mental health care standpoint, if you are suffering from something that a mental health care practitioner could help you with, do not be afraid to reach out. But from a spiritual standpoint, we deserve to be happy. We deserve to be happy. You know, there's been so much chaos just in my little community, various things going on. And the only thing, you know this, the only thing that we can control is how we respond to it. And so when someone is acting out, they're being disruptive. Um, you know, my neighborhood, people have been getting very disruptive and just... I don't know if they're getting stir crazy <laughs> and everyone's kind of acting out and not being considerate of one another, but, and, and being kind of cold to one another. We always have ourselves and we can always choose to find our serenity and to come on back in. And what's interesting, again, when we change the lens that we, <laughs> we use to see the world, you, you know how that ends, right? So that's what we maybe could choose today instead of focusing on everything that's wrong in the world. And especially instead of trying to focus on just being right, starting arguments just so you could be right, find your serenity, flow with that. I wanna just reiterate that this is different than being in denial. So I'm not saying just stick your head in the sand and pretend like nothing's going on in the world. But rather when you see it, witness it, you can still come back into you and not have to play into whatever negative emotion comes with the chaos. All right. So we're going to leave it there, guys. I'm sending you all so much love and take care. Bye-bye.